And I met him once. He was a very sweet guy, Arthur. You did? Uh, yeah. Great. Met him backstage somewhere with the faces, back, way yeah. back in the six, in the seventies. Yeah. Yeah. I never knew anything about him, you know, except this record. Never heard anything else fr from him. He was telling me about his collaborations with Sam. You know what was nice for well, go on. Yeah, because Rod was always so into Sam, Sam Cooke and yeah, Otis, yeah, you know. Yeah. But uh, nice thing I loved about that was because we'd do these songs just because we loved them so much and they were going in our yeah. stage act. And then that became our first record. And of course, all these guys saw these nice little royalty checks. And they're all going, hello. Hello. <laughs> There's money in this. <laughs> <laughs> if only we could get it off of the holding company. Mm. Oh, yeah. Don't go there. Hence all the grudges, you know, Bo Diddley, Chuck Berry, blah, blah, blah. they hated yeah, it. Yeah. They never got paid. It, no, I know. I got some early Beatles. Um, each member of the band got paid 10 shillings, um, seven pounds, 10 shillings for each session, which were, um, please, please me. You did in uh, nine hours in three, three hour sittings see, or see. something. Rich pickings. Yeah. Come on, man. That's the job for me. <laughs> Get paid like that. Brilliant. Yeah, yeah so uh, Arthur Alexander, who wrote that last song, um, he did, um, yeah, 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 if you ever do, 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 change your mind about leaving me behind. Leave yeah. it, leave me behind. Leave it, give it to me. Give your Bring your sweet loving. loving. Bring it on, Bring home, it on to home to me. me. Yeah, he wrote that with Sam Cooke. That's and, great. Um, yeah, he sang along. And I met him once, and uh, he seemed to be quite a very polite gentleman. The great ones usually are. Yep. 